Hello Divination, in this video I'm going to show you how to create a slide in top bar ad using DV's code module and the code pen code generator. Thanks once again to Andy Tran for sharing this tip with us. So without wasting a lot of time, let me show you what it looks like and how we managed to create it. So this is the slide in top bar ad with the DV code module. So let me show you how we managed to create this. As you can see, it's got a nice uh, background color. We can also customize this message to whatever you want. And also we can make this link, this button link to whichever website you want. And if you want to disappear, all you have to do is click this X and then it's gone. So let me show you how we managed to create that. So the first thing you need to do is to go to codepen.io and create an account. So to create an account, all you have to do is to come to the top right, click on sign up and then go for the free plan. Fill in all this information and then once you're done, click on sign up. So the next thing we need to do is to click this link, which can be found on our blog post. And I've also included the link to the blog post in the show notes below. So once you've clicked this link, it shows us the, it shows us this information. So here's where you can do some changes. So first of all, here is the message that's going to be shown on the ad so you can change this to whatever you want okay and also here where it says new and improved blog i mean that's also change that's also um, text that you can change to whatever you want now coming here to the bottom we have this um, link to your website so this link to the website you can actually link it to whatever you want so in this case i'm just going to link it to my domain name mac.live and then instead of um view blog for the sake of this tutorial just to show you that we can make these changes i'm just going to say visit so once you've typed that you can see here in this preview that uh, this is also updated on the actual preview here on the button which is pretty cool so with the mouse um, in this area here to save you need to press command s on uh, mac and control s on pc so I'm just going to do that. Now, the reason why we're doing that is because right now the information that's here uh, is Andy Tran and we can see this here in the URL. So we can see Andy Tran there. So once you've logged into your account, which I have, and you can see this by uh, taking a look at my picture right here at the top right. So we need to save this so that the code we're going to have with the changes that we've done now belongs to me. So I'm just going to go ahead and click on Command S. So now you can see at the top here, this URL now has Mac17, which is my um, username. Okay, so that's looking pretty cool. So what we need to do now is to copy this link and add it to the code generator. Now the code generator as well is linked in the show notes below. Okay, so here's the code generator. Now I'm gonna paste my link that I copied earlier on and then click on generate. So this is the code that we're going to paste in our code module. So I'm just, I'm just going to press this button, copy code. Okay, so now we're going to go into our website and add this ad. Right, so here I am in my website. I'm going to click on edit page. Okay, so I'm here on the page. The next thing I'm going to do is to click on add modules. And I'm going to look for the code. And then here is where I need to paste my code like that and then I'm going to click on save and exit and then I'm going to click update so that's all you need to do now if we do a quick view of this page we should see that ad come from the top of the website so I'm going to click on preview and there we go we can see right here at the top and we can see here that the button the button also links to my blog and you can always go back and change this text to whatever you want so definitely it's working now what if you want this ad to show throughout the whole website. Well, it's pretty straightforward. Let's go back into, into our, our website. And this time I'm going to go to Divi and then I'm going to go to theme options and I'm going to click on integration. So while you're here on integration, this is where you need to add the code. It needs to go under the, um, the head tag. So if you paste it here like that, and then you save, and then if we do a preview of the website, and I'm going to close this for now. So whatever page I'm going to click, that ad is going to show. See, like that. 
So there you have it. Thank you all for watching. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and do follow us on our social media platforms. We are creating regular content similar to what you're seeing today. Until next time, thanks for watching and see you soon.